Hello everyone, my name is Alvaro Quintero. My teammates are Michael Proa, Ryan Puran, and Lianet Pia. We're Team 16 and we're presenting our project on the Honda Motor Company. Small literature survey about Honda. Uh, its main focus is on the field of mobility and transportation. Honda has developed different branches. We worked on this field, such as Honda cars, Honda motorcycles, Honda aviation, among uh, many others. It is, since Honda works with transportation, it was very important to point out some uh, significant dates on this field of transportation. And we started uh, back in the year 4000 before Christ with the domestication of animals, uh, then in the year 31,000 before, uh, before Christ, the sailing boat was invented, and then if we move a lot uh, forward in 1903, the invention of the airplane came about. This is important for us since Honda approaches different domains that are related to transportation. For instance, on water, we have Honda marine engines. On the air, we have Honda jet. And then on land, we have the very well-known vehicles and motorcycles that uh, are very reliable and are very well-known around the world. Currently, Honda uh, is working on new trends that are coming about. For instance, in the field of robotics, they are working on a humanoid robot that is aimed to help people with handicaps. And they're also working on the field of self-driving vehicles. And currently they're in talks with Google to join a program named Waymo. So Chiro Honda and Takeo Fujisawa founded the Honda Motor Company in 1948 in Hamasa, Japan. Just a year later, the D motorcycle type was manufactured. It was their first original design and engineered product. Having started with a small one-room office as their headquarters, they opened their first storefront in Los Angeles, California, called the American Honda Motor Company. Mr. Honda influenced the company by his notion of diversity. The Hometown Forest Project was executed, which meant that all employees and management went outside the company and planted trees and plants in Japan. Back in the USA, America Honda Foundation has been committed to helping out the communities and they've awarded $32 million to every single state in the US. In 2008, Honda begins producing the Civic Sedan, opens its marine engine research facility in Florida, and Honda Aero begins construction in the North Carolina headquarters. In 2015, Honda Jet achieves certification from the Federal Aviation Administration and enters its two services after starting the first flight in 2010. Current popular Honda models include the Accord, Civic, and Ridgeline. Honda also manufactures its luxury brand, Acura, and Honda and Acura cars have most recently won these awards. 2017 Kelly Blue Book Best Buy Award Overall Winner, 2017 North America Truck of the Year, and one of Car and Driver's Top 10 Best. Honda cars currently feature innovations including Bluetooth connectivity, lane watch, and basic autonomous capability, including self park and automatic braking. Honda cars also feature remote engine start and powerful fuel efficient engines. The epitome of Honda engineering can be seen in the Acura NSX. This 3,900 pound beast has 573 horsepower, fueled by a 3.5 liter V6 twin turbo engine and three electric motors. The NSX also features a nine speed dual clutch transmission and regenerative braking. Unfortunately for Honda, the NSX hasn't sold as well as projected. The first model did sell in 2016 for $1.2 million and only 269 models have sold since. Reviews of the car feature numb steering, electric braking, and disconnected roll feel. Design suggestions for the NSX are to delete some of the electronic systems. Uh, consumer reviews are saying that there's too much disconnected feel between the car, the driver, and the road. Deleting some of these systems may relieve these factors. With the recent trends in the automobile industry, 
indicating that consumers want safer, greener, smarter, and more efficient vehicles, Honda has announced that by 2020, they want to lower carbon emissions by 30%. They have announced that by 2040, they want to completely eliminate vehicle collisions. And by 2050, they want to lower carbon emissions by 50%. In order to seek out and achieve these goals, Honda has introduced in the vehicle lineup the 2018 Honda Odyssey. It has managed to attain a five-star safety rating, and they've improved their emissions compared to the 2017 Honda Odyssey. They have introduced in the 2018 version a collision mitigation system, and they've introduced a lane-keeping assistance system. Along in their lineup is the 2018 Honda Clarity. It also has managed to attain a five-star safety rating, they have managed to improve the emissions by introducing their first zero emission vehicle with the fuel cell powertrain. It has the highest fit efficiency out of all the vehicles in the Honda on the line. They have managed to improve the range from 230 miles to 350 miles. With, the, with also the recent trends in the ride sharing industry, Honda has managed to tap into the market by introducing the first ever fully electronic ride sharing vehicle. It should, it should, called the NUV, the new electronic urban vehicle. It can be used for Uber Lyft purposes. It was also created for the purpose of monetizing the vehicle's downtime. It has an emotion engine and an artificial intelligence engine, which looks into the client's music demands and consumer tastes. 